what is up guys Bogogi from Bogogi's Jewelry World just wanted to come out to you guys with a quick video just uh I'm watching this watch video and and these Harlan Bling watches Eddie says that it uses the Myota movement and when you look at the little spinning rotor you can actually see the stamping for Myota and I'm watching this video called the rarest most expensive watches on earth and uh, let's just watch it together so you want to start there and then we can ascend up absolutely I'm, I'm very happy you picked out this one teddy this is the mad one by max booser mbnf we look for watches for people across all walks of life uh, looking for uh, the greatest watches regardless of price point this one has a starting bid of one thousand uh, dollars our published estimate is one thousand to two thousand dollars it's offered with no reserve so even a one dollar bid could win it theoretically um, this is a very sought after model. When uh, Max Booster introduced it, he made about 100 for his closest friends and, and supporters. Yet that's all you, you can get it for maybe a dollar. You don't know. You never know. I promise it's, you yeah, it will not go It won't be a dollar. <laughs> no reserve lots could sell for very low. Okay, but what do they trade for in the secondary markets now? The blue, the first version, was, was only made for his closest friends. And this is an even more exclusive version of the first version, made specifically for his brand partners. This one, uh, on the secondary market, if it wasn't the particular provenance that this one has, is probably twelve to 15000 on the secondary market for the blues. This one was actually donated for Time for Art, which is a special charitable auction we're holding in conjunction with Swiss Institute. It was donated by Eric Giroux, who is the legendary designer behind most of MBNF's creations. This was his personal watch, uh, donating to raise funds for so the Swiss Institute. So something for everybody in this auction. And what's really cool about this is this is a Miyota movement. And there is... You guys hear it right there? I'll back it up 10 seconds so you can hear it again. Buddy in this and what's really cool about this is this is a Miyota movement. Hold on. Okay, so I, I pulled up an article because, you know, they, they, they could just be talking out their ass. You don't know. And there you go. I type in F Miyota. Boom. So that's the movement that they're using inside. So this watch, still Miyota, still Miyota. So if you're going around saying that like these these watches are are not it, they don't keep time, the movement's not premium. That's one of the most expensive watches in the world, and if you don't think that these movements are premium, I don't know what to tell you. All right, shit, I'm out.